Yo, yo, Thrangulius here. We're back at it again with Wrench Feels Like Playing Under Space. I'm really enjoying this game, and uh, we're going to continue uh, on with Cardoz's story here. Um, we just found a new rival, um, Abezio. Um, we were tracking him down, trying to blow him up and try to capture him, but uh, ended up being a false false ship so now I guess uh, the uh, chapter that I'm with is looking for him and I'm not too sure if we caught a signal of him or something but uh, as we jump in here we'll kind of just take a look at our uh, mission logs and kind of see where we're at and uh, go from there um, really enjoying the combat once again in this game it's Doing, doing exactly what I want it to do, so it's always good. Okay, so we are back on Valdwick, I think. Or where are we right now? Baldwin? No active missions, we just completed. Zet's breakthrough. Don't necessarily remember what that was about. Um, maybe let's just head over to the chapter house and see if this prompts anything. Oh, missing uh, a couple of the people who you normally hear. Mm, I guess the Idol Smashers had everything work out okay. Good show all around. Are you part of all this? Me? No. I fly all the valuable drakes over at Azir Academy. Just popped in for some fancy booze and checked my UPT before I'm out to meet with an old ARC friend of the Red Tooth. That's where the big stories are happening. You've been out to Red Tooth at all? I've been hearing some strange rumors, mark me. Benevolent storm ripes or whole guild builders cities, you know? I'm more of a rookie. Fresh out of the academy. Fair enough. Hat's got a chip on his chasing about you. His casing about you. But Croft knows I'm going to turn down help if or not. Still, if you're flying green, I take you to look for some advice. If you have any. Not sure I'm the best person to come to for that, honestly. Advice, that is. Though, I'd say I'm well-traveled. I could at least give you a crash course in star chasing if you want. Pretty sure I've already seen this. Sounds fine. Perfect. What do you want to know more about? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I've already kind of went through this. Maybe remind me what the UHC is. Not much to say. You didn't have drilled in your head as in the academy. The UHC is the union. They pay us, tally our points, and help organize the chapter. Mark me. Don't get on the bad side. Stop charge. The top star chasers are scary, but people. The UHE got squads out there that, well, let's just say internal affairs is a bit different. Okay. 
Interesting. Um. Okay. Well. Does that prompt anything? Probably not. No. I wonder if, like, as soon as I undock, maybe something will happen. I don't know. I'm not too sure what's uh, necessarily going on right now. So I have 131,000 credits. Pretty freaking good. So let's see if we can maybe go. What about crafting, really? It's not craftable. Drunken battleship crafting item. An, an aging ship that through some strange force has been shrunk small enough to fit into a large bottle. With the crew long dead, the miniature sized military components should be used to jury rigor a broken piece of hardware back to service. So doing so will cannibalize the entire battleship. What does that even mean? Well, it's not doing anything else with the shit, so we'll just do that. Hmm. Okay, so we're going to go to equipment dealer. Take a look. See if there's anything cool. Sunbeam. Photonic repeater made specifically for a mass production and civilian use. Photonic weapons do more damage to neutrino shields, but less to quasar. They have a very high fire rate, but do low damage to trade off. Oh, that's already what I have. I wasn't really paying attention there. Okay. Uh, Glutonic, that normally sell security companies and high family bodyguard. Glutonic weapons do more damage to Antec shields, but less to Quasar. Typically, Glutonic weapons do damage as high damage in exchange for low fire rate, high energy usage. Yeah, let's not even bother. I already am like hurting with the web eater. What else have we got here? Is there any heavy equipment? High powered railgun that fires superheated super steel under steel at targets near FTL velocity. The resulting projectile is devastating, especially at large targets. So this is like a battleship killer. Particularly developed by Baldwin. Sunspot creates a ball of superhedra thermo before providing a small boost at a specific direction. The projectile persists for several seconds before becoming unstable and exploding. Despite its obvious con connotations, the demanding V have expressed their disapproval for the gun's existence. I'm just going to go with the arc cannon. It seems simpler. Big gun goes big boom. Uh, does the same shield as hull damage, so it's just a big ass fucking gun. So we will just take that, I guess, for now. We still have 56,000 left over. the countermeasures there's effectiveness 70% compared to 60% that's a difference of like 40k I'm just gonna go with the second one and call her a day it's not really like I need them I haven't really noticed the enemies firing too many missiles at us but 
might as well equip it, maybe get used to, uh, get used to it. Okay. So, right now it doesn't seem like we have any kind of, like, missions or anything right now, so I'll probably just... Great. Drinking mug, beloved photograph. What the hell is all this? Check a grove. I don't understand. Special item. Weird. Go to the job board. They have one. Really not much. I almost rather go and do like military missions. Which I am gonna back out and let's just head over to uh, maybe a military battleship or something like that. Get some more more cash flow. Eventually here, I'm going to have to figure out some trade routes and do a little bit of freight running, but for now, I will just be doing missions to make a little bit of more money. I finally kind of have my ship fully outfitted with what we can do here. Interesting. Hey, Carda, is you busy at all? Not particularly. What's going on? I'll spare you the legal details after my latest case managed to be on my hands for Bottle Squad 33. Wash your brew wine. Uh, not illegal to drink, merely to sell, handle in public, not talk to anyone about. Why well, don't you swing by the office? We can get it out. Care for a package for you. Consider me interested in nothing else. Okay, so I just have to turn around and go back. Okay. Definitely like, I like, at first didn't realize what I was doing with the auto docking, but like, when you can actually manually dock, it actually makes this a lot faster. Auto docking is super slow and complicated. You can just auto dock or, or I mean manual dock. It's way faster. I definitely like that feature. Let's go on to the office. More drinks with Carvel. You've got it good here. I don't want to uncork a bottle just yet, in case it starts to scream. Another round of drinks? Another gift? Absolutely. Thanks. Now, from what I understand, the wine works best when you're feeling particularly nostalgic. So, I'll leave a toast to you. What do we remember of this fine day, my fine friend? Hmm. I don't really know, but... I guess the friends and family gone? And Andre again, I take it? Take me back to the days before all this. He used to follow us around like we lost Kit. Not the smartest man, your brother. He was caring. That's what mattered. True. What did Teleria, Teleria always call him? A happy idiot? A loving, lovable, handsome idiot. That's for sure. I remember the Upper Harvest Fall, remember? Back in 67? He sculled the corner while apparently every eligible girl was 8-5 that year. Poor not Jandre. Jandre. That so many ladies after them, you'd think we'd all become veilers. It was like something out of a middle, bad middle number romance novel. I was never particularly. You're not caring much. You're not missing much. Too many love triangles. Too many relationships based drama. I was always more of a fan of the rare number of novels. Or something more appealing about two souls intertwined, overcoming all of the struggles of living together. 
give me that any day. Not particularly into those either. Fair enough. I do recall you used to be quite the book reader though. Many days we lose to your mother's libraries just reading about the great deeds of ancient kings and queens. Wow. Potent oh, stuff by this wine. You want another glass? Or are we done here? Uh I'll just I'm just gonna say it's strong. Shouldn't have another. I don't blame you. It's definitely taking me aback. Hope we don't have long term side effects. Tasty though. I definitely keep the rest for another day. Of course, it's not just a glass of wine I wanted to give you. My latest client was stockpiling missiles of some sort in the Doom Sight scenario. Something about this insane washer cult coming to kill us all. Illegal and at least the level it was doing it. At least at the level he was doing. As serendipity would have it, your l latest al altercations meant it was true. Which let me get him free of a technicality. Though he had surrendered his explosives, still I managed to have his launcher and pack of ammunition for it left over. I think a star chaser would make a good use of it. I'll take it. Perfect. I'll arrange it to be delivered to your cargo bay. Some uh, same as last time. I don't know if I'll have anything else, but still free, real free to visit Cardoz. I don't see you very often. Bones under launcher. Bones under missile. I already have. I already, I already have. I believe. So we are going to head out. remember where we had those good missions at. As their academy? I kind of feel like it was there. Let's take a look over there. Yeah, Definitely gonna have to figure out these uh, different type of mm, like missiles and stuff. So, our active weapons use equipment. I feel like that was the one that was supposed to be. Fire head. I'm gonna have to take a look and see what that is. Fire heavy two. Countermeasures at sea makes sense. Launch mines. Hold V. Don't think I'll be holding. Press.
hold C for active cloak. Yeah, I definitely feel like this is supposed to be uh, X. Oops, let's see. Oh, weird. I'm not going to be able to do both. That's so weird. That's so weird how that works. It didn't work that way. Because you have B and B right there. Why the hell does C and C not work? That's so stupid. Hmm. If there's any other kind of no, so I have to like select which. I'm not too big fan of that. I guess I would have to just get used to it. I guess I got a couple of washers to take care of. Good practice. Oops, that was a waste. I'm blowing the missiles up sometimes. No, please, I have a well, should have thought of that before uh, attacking me. I'm just gonna head out. I ain't gotta prove nothing. Uh, damn it. Definitely heading the wrong way. Where am I? Now I'm confused. We don't get stopped. Mm -hmm. yeah. oh, I believe you are clear to launch. Good luck out there. Love it, Skyward.
as our academy. Just see if there's any cool missions in here. Make some dough. Maybe it'll prompt some uh, more story mode later on here. Chapter house in here. What does that even mean though? I'm not entirely sure. Track new stuff. 50,000. Interesting. Well, I'm just going to Baldwin military. Delete. Power bound. High valued and trusted asset of the Baldwin Senate. We'd like you to task you with the taking down a particularly select target. A heavily defended transport carrying a specific cache of information. Restore the transport and return with the data cache to us. It's important to note that carrying this data cache is considered a felony. If you're caught with it, we will have to deny involvement. Nevertheless, this job needs to get done and will maintain certain delicate but political balances within Valdrick's region. It's a lot of risk and not a whole lot of reward, man. Hunt down and kill. Assassination. We've gotten word that Mistel Ketelteri, one of the highest ranking members of the Mata, has recently arrived in the system. Mistel Kata has been at the top of our most wanted list for years. We cannot let this opportunity pass us by. We have a member of the Lobbit shipping may now know their whereabouts. You are cleared to use any technique you deem necessary to find and eliminate your target. I will accept that mission for 20k. It's pretty straightforward. Seek and destroy. See if there's a. Oh wow. So. Let's talk to them. Speaking, what do you need? Interesting. What the fuck? Ship just fucking blew through, like, blew up in the planet there. That's hilarious. scan B even though of course
Weird how that doesn't work. Can I see it again? Bitches. Oops. Definitely didn't mean to do that, but Shit, that took some of my shit out. Definitely like how fast those track. No, please, above, no. Definitely freaking love the combat now that I upgraded. Like, I keep saying it, but like, yeah. At first, I was like super like worried that I just really sucked at aiming, but it just ended up being that my guns really suck. But now that I upgraded, it just really feels so much better. nice to know that I'm not just like constantly missing it's just that my guns kind of really suck and that I was missing but got him be over right now? Didn't I blow him up? I feel like I did that. Oh man. Did this just glitch out for some reason?
the hell? Did I not just blow him up? What the hell? Yo, are we serious right now? Did I not do that? I'm so confused. Pretty sure that just freaking glitched out. That sucks. That sucks. We'll just have to cancel it and try again. Hopefully nothing will glitch out the second time. Really unfortunate, but not the end of the world. the drop board again hopefully this time it won't fuck us over hunt down and kill well we'll try this again hopefully this time it freaking pays out 32k try this again Washers recently arrived in the system. Please press the spy. Oh, yeah. Can I help you? Damn it. Maybe this is not the person we're trying to get to? Shit. 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 Uh... Lobbit Shipping Yard may know their whereabouts. Contact. Find your... Yeah, I'm not too sure what's going on here.
kind of feel weird. Like, yeah, this mission type is just keeps glitching out on me, or am I just not understanding it? Being a mid of the washers has recently arrived the system. Been on top of our boss wanted. Pass us by. Members of the Wobbit shipping may know where they were about. Clear to use any technique you know. Okay, so the Lobbit shipping. So is there a do they have like a base of operations? have to search out and find some guys of that company I guess weird we're not gonna go that way Try Raven Star Spire and maybe we'll find some members of the Lobbit Tripping Company. Not too sure. The washers. Oh, Lobbit Refueling Platform. gun that's doing that? Seems like it. Interesting. Still trying to figure out some of the new mechanics here, like that auto turret's kind of cool. Didn't think that was going to be a thing. Talk to one of these guys. Tell me who Chief Bear is. Okay, okay, mark it on the map. Don't hurt me. Okay. It is good. Hopefully this time it doesn't glitch out on us. You're no match for me. 
Pretty sure about that. Priest cheap bird. stock some of our ma missiles and then I'm not too sure like what we should be doing here I'm gonna dock with the big battleship, see what that is, see what that's like. That's not bad. A tier two ship. Two hundred and sixty thousand. Damn. It is quite a bit better, I believe, than the ship I have. Wow. Two C class six, four class seven. Wow. Two hundred sixty thousand to buy. We'll sell my small little light fighter there. Ninety thousand. Even then, the ship's not big enough, or can't sell for enough here. So interesting, though. So there are more expensive and better ships. They still have the same look as other ships, but. I'm wondering if once this game actually comes out, they'll probably have different class types and stuff, uh, different uh, different type ships here. Um, let's go equipment dealer. Maybe let's see what they have to sell here. Is there anything different? No. It's all fairly similar. So weapons. Nav 
one dog. Class six. I can only go class four with this ship. Cloaking field. You guys have any cloaking? No. Field. Unit, all still like all that's just expensive as hell. Scanner, high scanner. Yeah, we'll buy one of those. Super kit for a hundred thousand. Mechanical optimizations for your engines that increase acceleration and cruise time. There's quite a bit of different parts, including extra thruster, or spatial spoilers, and flame paint. Interest. Okay, well, we're gonna restock all our stuff. And then let's head to the bargain. But at least there's a, something to look forward to when it comes to uh, ships there. Uh. See if we can get a better paying mission. The next two in here. Nope, all worse. Try again. I'm hoping for like a thirty thousand. The Baldwin military mission still on this ship as well. So twenty-four thousand kind of seems like the only one that we're getting here. So we'll just take one of those. To seek and destroy mission again. Let us launch. You are clear to launch. Good luck out there. There someone we're supposed to talk to, probably then load it. Lob it shipping, you know. We will just head out. Our See if we spot any load it, lob it traders. Us, Necropolis, us first. This our stop for the Dolphin Spirit requesting. This is Ocean Bridge, Ace 2, Agonization, requesting docking permission. Ocean Bridge. Can you scan again? Seemingly scan this guy. Hmm. Oh, that's not a big deal. That's not what we're looking for. We're looking for some traders. Wonder where we could like find one of those just out of the blue. Mark it on the map. Sweet. Behind planet Baldwin. Or Baldwin.
background's nice. Planets look cool. I'm definitely enjoying the, the landscape of this game. Or the spacescape, I guess. in our bank. We're in our 20k emissions, so we'll get up to 80. Yeah. I wonder what prompt story missions. If it's just maybe overall just wealth build and I think that's how Freelancer kind of upgraded its stuff. As, as more wealth you get you get better missions and then that's how you progress the story, I guess. Oh shit. Yep, kind of ran right into that one. Whoa, what the fuck is this? What is this? What the hell is all that? There we go. That's nuts, dude. Auto cannon is kind of crazy. Uh, the auto turret is freaking crazy. It drains your energy, but like doesn't miss and it fucking just eats them. It's crazy. Yeah, I definitely like ran right into that mine. But what the hell? That effect was crazy. Okay. I'm curious to see. I'm gonna land on the... No. No, no, no. The battleship... Or, no, that's super far away. Avistrom Outpost. Too serious. Police stuff. Foot dealer. Anything cool? Not really. Ooh, 
Okay. Nothing cool. Um. The highest mining depot in Guerrero, 77 bucks. Ezra Academy, I can buy for five. And I can buy for six from the south post. I can buy 30. That'd sell quite a bit. We need a trader. I think we're gonna just try maybe doing a trade route right now we're gonna go buy a buy a freighter if we can i don't know if like we can buy lesser levels at this point or if that might have just been at that one space station where we can buy like the heavier stuff but i wanted to give a, a, a freight run a try we've already done a couple of missions to make some money let's see how much we can kind of finagle with some freight i think the lower class freighters don't necessarily carry all that much cargo i think it's only like 80 which is not the greatest that next freighter up there that cost like 260,000 had like 150 cargo which wasn't too bad okay it's kind of difficult freaking sometimes to select you want to select So let's let's see if we buy a, maybe a, just a smaller freighter let's do a freight run to Guerrera maybe selling water maybe there's better options here we'll go see so we're gonna go ship dealer we can definitely afford a max cargo 80 max cargo 80 it's just a matter of look at this point. They both are the same specs. Looks like it. Verification game plus two. I'm gonna just go with the Skyhawk. Only does 80 cargo, but kind of to be expected for a smaller freighter and then we'll as we upgrade we will go from there so let's swap to this ship 57,000 we do have to be aware that cargo trader that we do not have great weapons right now If I want like consumer goods, 67,000 or 67 to four. Cultural goods, 16 to buy, but 184 to sell. I cast a circle, which is actually not that bad. That's within the system. Medical supplies, not really worth it there. The only problem with Castle Circle is that I gotta. All my enemies are there, so it's like I can't. I don't think I'll be able to dock there, to be honest. So maybe that's not something I should be looking at there. All of this is within the system. Oh, that's interesting. 213. 23 to 213. Battleship Caldron. Once again, within the system. That's crazy. Atmos gas. Not much. Guerrera. 8 to 145. That's a pretty good one. 30 to 360, basically. In Valdrick, Ravenstar Spire. Like, that's a pretty freaking gnarly conversion. 
Starship port. Uh, I might actually, I don't know, man. That seems pretty freaking good to me. Am I crazy? I guess I could just do the quick math here and the conversion right there. Eleven to one, almost twelve to one. I do this one, which is in a different system, so it doesn't really. I, w I wouldn't kind of do that one. What other one was kind of really good? The luxuries, yeah. Twenty-three, so nine so honestly the the starship course kind of seems like a really good one yeah i'm gonna do that cool so we're gonna do starship course buy that and go to ravenspire valdrick best known price um let's go equipment dealer see if we can afford maybe a couple of guns we don't even have guns mounted that's pretty bad okay so if we go so two class twos two class threes two class fours so we just go with the web eater obviously we need one of those which is a class two so there's one of our class twos and then I would definitely consider putting a m missile on here. I go weapons. Delivers micro missiles, which is designed ultra fast, rapidly fired. I don't know why I wouldn't just go with the regular as bones under. I'm gonna go with that. And then class three. Let's go with a sunbeam, class three. And then another sunbeam, class three. That's all we got. But at least we got something. Um, let's restock if we can. No. Let's maybe just buy some ammo as much as we can. All of it. Awesome. Okay. Let's hop out of here. Go to... Is this the Battle Spire? I think that's where I'm supposed to go. We'll probably end up getting j stopped by uh, washers or someone, but that's part of the game when you're running freight. But this is crazy, like how much that twelve to one within in the own within the system too. Like that's maybe I should look where I'm going. Raven Star Spy, right there. So we just gotta go boom and boom. So. Now that I've tried out the auto cannon, yeah, the the turret is almost like a must have, especially for like like a ship like this. Like hell yeah, like an auto cannon would be freaking crazy here or whatever. An auto turret gun just gives you a little bit more freedom. Like you can run away, you don't necessarily even have to be looking at your freaking enemy. Pretty sweet, I must say. 
So I don't know how that's gonna work out for a freaking PvP though. That's kind of cheeky for PvP. I like think it's kind of like an auto aim weapon there. Like I don't know if I'm gonna like that PvP. I wonder if like servers you can maybe dis disallow certain type of that might be a thing with the servers might be able to like not allow certain gun types because like it that just seems too cheeky like there's not really much skill in that you just freaking turn your auto count and gun on and blast away so i wonder yeah if they uh they'll add options on the servers to uh, online servers to uh eliminate certain things all right that's moment of truth i guess they were selling the they said 360 they were selling them for it's a really short distance and it's 12 to 1. i guess the enemies are here but it doesn't matter i'm literally docking right now or was done. Okay, let's go do the cargo trader. And moment of truth, three freaking fifty nine. Wow, so twenty eight thousand, just like that. Sell cargo. So there's definitely, probably, definitely, probably. <laughs> There's probably better better trade routes eventually around the place here. I wonder if I have to like visit certain places before I can actually tell about prices. Twenty seven one thirteen. These aren't the greatest. Well, let's go equipment dealer. Let's see if I can buy a couple, maybe one more gun here. Maybe, probably not actually. Class four weapon. I can afford one of them. Four per second shot, a scrubber. Do it. Reach level 12. Sweet. Level up. We're gonna go one for the missile. We have plus eight and max ammo. We'll go up for the shield downtime to 0.76. Not bad. Looking at a reputation right now. Definitely good with the good guys, technically. The cops in the military, but bad with the bad guys. Okay, so we are gonna go. There's like there's not much to freaking trade here. truck two hundred and sixty thousand I'll carry a hundred and fifty cargo I'll have a little bit of time before I can afford that um 
Okay, let's just launch. Like, that was a really short trip for 28k. Payout. I don't know how much I spent, but I think I feel like it was like 4k. It would have been nice if there was like a return. Some sort of return route, but I guess not. Washes her attacker and Mata. I'm already out of here though. Well, that was 28k. Pretty quick 28k. I guess we can kind of just shop around and just kind of take a look at some stations here, but you would think like a... I wonder if I have to visit a place in order to see the prices, the best prices. So I almost have to like explore um, some of these maps. Okay, so if I Roger that, you are clear to dock. Proceed to dock number one. Dock here. Let's just see what they have to sell if they have anything good. Six to one. Oh, it's fine. Buy as much as I can. Head on out. Go to the Agonite station. believe that's next to planet Baldwin. Or Valdric? The 12 to 1 is the, the biggest I've seen so far. I have to visit some places in order to see their prices. I'm assuming that's probably the case. Trigger. 
firearms. 27k, not bad. 4 to 27, so I made 23. Chorm, 37. Right there. Twelve to one. Seven to one. Where is that? As our academy? Is just another jump over. So that's a twelve to one just with one white within one jump space. Cost me two hundred and forty. So there must be some like higher amounts of trade off here, conversions. I just came from Ezar, I believe, right? Like, that's exactly where I just came from. You could just keep going back and forth between Ezar and Agnite. And just pump money. Which is exactly what I'm gonna do, it seems. Sorry, that might seem fairly boring to watch, but uh, I'm definitely... Oh! Okay, well here we go. Here's some combat in between here. Uh, we're not gonna do that, so we're just gonna have to fight. Hopefully we can uh, handle ourselves here. It seems like we can, though. They wanted a fight. It's a fairly small transport, so it's fairly mobile still. The get turns definitely slower. Probably easier to hit as well. Daddy him. You're the ones who wanted to fuck around and find out. You did. Academy or the planet? Shit. I think it was the Academy. Might have been the planet. Watch out for that. I don't have to do that again. Okay. Oh, 
Cargo trader. Am I in the right place? 37. 2000. Okay, so no, that was not worth it. So. Okay, so how do I gotta think about this? So that wasn't the greatest transaction. Okay. Weird. In consumption. Does that mean it's cheaper? I wonder if the prices drop. Am I crazy here? I think the prices drop. In consumption. Interesting. So the prices fluctuate, so you can't just fucking cheese a, a run. Okay, okay. Shit. Okay. We will launch. All right, well, I think that's where we're going to end it today on uh, Wrench Feels Like Playing Underspace. If you liked what you saw, feel free to drop a like and subscribe. It would really help a lot for the channel to grow, and appreciate it a lot. Until next time. Peace.